Well, here at our Steve Duro Clubhouse, there's um, there's six clubhouses in Tucson. At ours, everyone is different. Here, we mainly um, we play basketball. We have the best basketball teams here. Um, we run different kinds of programs like um, street smarts, um, kids smart, girls smart, and we teach these kids to be active with each other, uh, be active in school. Keeps kids out of trouble, keeps them off drugs, keeps them in school, um, off the streets, staying healthy. We have uh, programs called Healthy Habits, and we teach them how to eat right, um, how to exercise right, things of that. Kids come here as a safe haven. And to get away from the bad things that are in their area that they live in, um, they feel like this is a second home to them. So they come here, they play with us, they do their programs, and sometimes these kids don't want to leave. But they feel safe here, and it's a fun place for them to come. I started working here because um, I started coming to the Boys and Girls Club when I was 10, and my sister was a hack, which was like a work experience program. And I would just come tag along, and I ended up loving it. I was on the volleyball team here. I um, made a lot of new friends, and... They gave me the Youth of the Year scholarship. So it's a Youth of the Year scholarship is um, scholarship to college. They start like two years at Pima, then you go to four years for U of A, and then keep going. Depends on the stages you pass. When I decided to come back to the Boys and Girls Club, it was because I wanted to be a part of like their um, the kids' lives and be you know a mentor and help them with anything they needed help with. And I felt like this was a great place for me to be, and the staff were really helpful. And I just wanted to be, I wanted to give back too because I'm a sophomore in college so a lot of these kids we we do change their lives we don't see it sometimes but they'll come back and say thank you and help you help me do this and we just didn't realize that we did it and we did change a bunch of kids and we're still doing it if they have problems that they can't solve they always bring them to me anyways and I help them solve them um tell them to keep pushing forward don't give up if something is hard, it's supposed to be. Um, nothing's given to you, nothing's easy. So if something does come up hard, keep pushing forward. Don't give up, never give up.